Shop early. Stay safe. Shop local. Those are the themes of a special shopping weekend experience being planned by local businesses and the Manchester Business Association to help merchants and shoppers alike navigate the unusual circumstances brought about by the COVID-19 pandemic. During the weekend of November 6th through 8th, many local businesses will be offering special deals and discounts as a way to encourage visitors and local residents alike to stop by and take advantage of bargains. Carrie McKinnon, the owner of Vermont Kitchen Supply, and Jackie Baker, co-owner of Mother Myra's, the confectionery shop, met up a while ago with other local business owners to see if they could chart a course through the final months of the year, which typically are important ones in their run-up to the holiday season. So far we have about 40 business businesses participating. Um, it ranges from inns and restaurants to um, to retail stores, um, some massage therapists, so some independent contractors as well. Everybody's offering some sort of a special. That's right. Um, a discount, discount right, yep, right. coupons, even discounts on gift cards. So if people come in and they want to buy gift cards instead of the actual items, they right. can do that at some of the listed stores. Right. And the um, Manchester Business Association will actually have a link on it as will all of our individual businesses will be posting that same link and it will link you to the list of participating um, merchants and um, businesses and show you what they're actually offering for that weekend. The shop early message may sound familiar since it also implies the opportunity to shop more than once but that will take on extra resonance this year since the supply chains are a lot less certain than normal they say driving force behind it is that, you know, in my industry, um, and Jackie has some good points too, in my industry, we're having a big problem getting product. There's a lot of companies that have closed, a lot of companies that aren't shipping very quickly, a lot of companies that are sold out of merchandise. Correct. So right now is the time that my selection is the best, and I would love it to be that my regular customers would come and take advantage of some of those specials that we have right now. This point was seconded by Chris Morrow of the Northshire Bookstore. Uh, this is an abnormal year on, on many fronts. Uh, obviously, COVID is number one. And most of our businesses uh, just won't be able to accommodate the number of people that we normally get for the two weeks before Christmas. Um, we're just going to be limiting the number of people in the stores. So um, we're just hoping to get that, the awareness of that out and to encourage people to plan ahead more this year and to come in early. Um, uh, you know, that weekend is just one part of uh, what we're doing. You know, we have big signs up saying October is the new December. And as soon as November rolls around, we'll switch it to November is the new December. And uh, um, anything we can do to get people um, in the bookstores and the, all the local stores, um, you know, before the crunch in the weekdays, preferable to the weekends and, you know, just in, in uh, slower times so that um, everyone can stay safe and businesses can stay afloat. The shop safe part needs a little explanation, of course. Social distancing and mask wearing have been par for the course since the pandemic erupted on the scene last March. But shop local takes on added meaning as well, as online and mail order sales continue to absorb more consumer spending dollars, forcing local bricks and mortar businesses to continually adjust. The Manchester Business Association, an organization created a few years ago in the wake of the collapse of the former Manchester and Mountains Chamber of Commerce, is also involved. John Burnham, the association's executive director, describes their role. Uh, Carrie reached out to me and, and, and we started chatting and uh, this, and I said, oh, th th this is an easy thing. You know, we actually, <laughs> you know, we, we can help you create a design, um, a messaging. We can use our Man uh, ManchesterVermont.com website to promote this event um, with a, and also help with the outreach to local businesses and lodging establishments and services and see if we can even increase the participation list of offers and so forth to make this a really extraordinary weekend for 
Manchester and the surrounding area as a whole. Um, and that's how it all began. Then I became involved. And now it's live on the website. If you go to manchestervermont.com and you look at our shop, uh, shop early, stay safe, um, shop local campaign that's out there for the weekend of November 6th through the 8th. Um, you'll see all the participating businesses and uh, it's exciting. Uh, and more will join actually. We're still working with some other businesses who are trying to create their offers. They'll be added as we go along all the way up to November 6th. You can visit ManchesterVermont.com for a list of the local shops and what they are offering that first weekend in November. For the GNAT-TV News Project, I'm Andrew McKeever.